Shalom Arno. Giving our praise to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Bakakwadas. Double honors to the elder apostles, great millstone. Shalom to the hopeful elect. <laughs> the Israelites are a special people unto the Most High Yahweh. Let's go to Deuteronomy 7, chapter 6, verse. For thou art a holy people unto the Lord thy power. The Lord thy power have chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people. It's very simple. That are upon the face of the earth. So the Hebrew Israelites are above all people that are upon the face of the earth. A holy people chosen, a chosen people. A special people unto himself, the Most High Yahweh. And that's something that we should feel good about, that the Lord chose us, the so-called Blacks, Hispanic, and Native American Indians, the Israelites. Yasharala, he, Prince of the Power. Twelve tribes of Israel come from Jacob. One of the sons of Isaac. Isaac, the son of Abraham, a friend of the Most High. Let's go to Romans, Romans 9. Who are the Israelites? Let's go and take it more deeper, be more specific into who the Israelites are. Romans 9th chapter. Romans 9th chapter 4th verse. Who are Israelites? To whom pertaineth the adoption? That's heavy right there. And we should break down each part of this scripture. The Israelites pertain to the adoption. The Israelites were adopted back by the Most High. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Is that something? And the glory. So whatever that's glorious pertains to the Israelites. And the covenants. So the Most High made a covenant with his chosen special people unto himself. A covenant. And the giving of the law. The law is going to be put in the inward parts of the elect of the, Israel, of the house of Israel. And the law. And the only one that can keep the law is the Israelites. Is that something? And the service of the Most High. So the only one that can truly serve the Most High is the Israelites. Got to break it down like this. And the promises. Whatever, whatever promise that the Most High made is for the Israelites. Every promise. If he promised the crown of life, he promised salvation is for the Israelites. Is that something? And the scripture breaks it down. Piece by piece. The adoption, the glory, the covenant, the giving of the law, the service of the Most High, and the promises. The Israelites are a special people, unto, a holy special people above all people unto himself. Is that something? And then it goes on on the 13th verse. As it is written, Jacob I have loved, Esau I have hated. Jacob goes into the 12 tribes of Israel, starting with the tribe of Judah, all the way down to the tribe of Issachar. The Lord loves Jacob, but he hates Esau. It's very simple. Malachi 1 and 4 says that he has indignation for them, for Esau, forever. Very simple. Giving all praise to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Hashem Rakaha Kwadash, double honors to the elder apostles, great millstone. Shalom to the hopeful elect. Who are the Israelites? Morning Bible lesson. On to the next one, Shalom.